In this lesson, we're going to be talking about the basics of bending a note and vibratoing a note. So the general idea with bending is that we're going to select a note, let's say 7th fret on the 3rd string, and we're going to start from that note, we're going to bend the note out of shape to augment the note to something else. So what we want to do initially is if we're going to bend a note, we've got to figure out what note we want to bend to to make sure it's in tune. So for now, we're going to do a semitone bend or a half bend to make seven sound like eight. So that's a really important thing. If we want our bends to be in tune, we need to have a reference point. So practice that. We'll start from seven. We'll hear the eighth fret. And then we're gonna bend into that note. Now what I wanna do is play ninth fret now. And we're gonna bend seven into ninth fret. So this is called a full tone bend or a whole tone bend, we were essentially bending that note up so it sounds like it's two frets above. So we're playing seven till it sounds like nine. And that's the basics of the bend idea. Okay, so now that we've done bending, I also wanted to talk about vibrato. Now vibrato is kind of similar to bending, but instead of bending the note out of shape to a different note, we're just gonna do what I call, or I've heard being called micro bends, where we're just bending the note slightly out of shape to give it a bit of movement. And I try to picture a straight line that's going a little bit wavy. So I wanna take a close up of what I'm doing and try and explain it in a bit more detail. Okay, so let's pick a note. Let's say seventh fret of the third string. I wanna play that note. Now if I just leave it there, that's pretty boring. But what we can do to make it more interesting is to add that light vibrato technique. And picture that wavering line. So one thing I want you guys to practice is to try vibratoing nice and slow with a couple of different fingers. Now generally find that slow wave sounds a lot better than a panicky fast sort of billy goat bleat sound or even like a bee buzzing. So the nicest vibrato is for us to just start off nice and slow and get a slow wave and practice it with your point in your middle and your ring. If you feel confident, you can practice it with the pinky as well. 